Hello and welcome everyone, our heart here with part 15 of my 8 Princes Let's Play with Simi Yong, Total War 3 Kingdoms. We continue where we left things off last time. Thank you once again for your comments, advice, tactics and suggestions. They're all greatly appreciated. Do keep them coming. So picking things up where we left them last time, we just started going through the end turn phase when Simaway's forces that uh, were in the lumber camp have finally sallied out against us they do outnumber us fairly substantially they've got 5103 against our force of 2716 but of course we've got trebs and we have some very powerful cavalry so let's dive on in and smash their faces <laughs> Okay, so reinforcements coming in from over there. I think it's just the, um, the little tiny garrison that was in the lumber camp. The main force is their, their army that's been sat in there. So I think there's like four units coming on in. So we don't need to worry about that. They're selling out to me. Plus, even if they weren't, we've got Trebs. So they will keep heading to me anyway. Uh, we've got Vanguard on these guys. Good, because that is a wonderful position to have them right there. This little mound... Just cresting the top of it, and then we'll have our archers in front. Bombard, bombard our foes. Shield wall for the infantry. Oh, wait, they can't. <laughs> they can't. Vanguard deploy. All right. Simi Yong with the cataphracts that can't vanguard. Um... Yes, we'll have you here because we'll pop you guys over in this little patch of tree. Oh, wait, we can't reach that either. Oh, we can. it's fine. We can go further afield. In fact, we can have these guys waiting for the reinforcements, destroy the reinforcements, and then swing into the back of their main force. There we go. They're all hidden out. Lovely stuff. Um... So, in that case, I won't bother hiding you guys, I think. Let's have you all, all here. That should be fine. Crash just with your bow. Sentinel, you'll come on up with these guys. Start the battle. Move on in. Bring the cavalry up. Well, that's good there. Blanks exposed. Probably just lots of... Yeah, there's lots of G militia, so we'll have to be careful with our cavalry charges. But if we wait till the opportune moment, we can get a good strike in. Okay, we're actually hmm, probably going to have to risk going for it now. Just because they're not moving forward with these guys towards my trebs just yet. So let's see if we can't just divide and conquer them up a little bit. Know, we've already managed to do that with this first unit. Go find those archers for me. I know they've got cavalry, so they might have brought them back. That's it. Lure them away. And then strike from the other side. This is where it gets a little bit dangerous. That's it. They've gone. You guys head this way. And archers. Go, go, go. Guys, in range of my trebs yet? Nearly. Could just do a ground attack there because any missed shots probably hit some of them anyway. That's that first volley anyway. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Pull back a little bit. His archers have gone. That's it. Keep pulling those two units away. 
from the rest of my cavalry charges through the bamboo. That's that's beautiful. That's gorgeous. That's how you wipe them all out. That is not a cavalry fail. <laughs> Volley on these guys. Because of that, they've had to leave some infantry back. You guys go up here. We do have their cavalry free over this side. Does concern me a little bit. Yeah, let's have a let's have a duel. Quickly swing on round steel. Um, and cavalry. There we go. Oh, wow. A big old hit. Might have to run away. I was hoping a tenacity of steel might even things up. Alright, she's going to need to run away. Just pull back. And Trebs. Are on these guys at the back. Because our cavalry is storming on through. There we go, you've all got your charges sorted. They're being pummeled by Trebs. You want to come on in there and finish them off. Catch this cavalry charge. Just realize the red on red is pretty confusing for our units. Throw in some blood as well. Who's who? Cataphracts pull back. And Trebs, thankfully, have just run out of ammo. Bring the Cataphracts round. Miyong, knock down the strategist. If you please. Show them the way. Triple speed it while we cut down a few more of them because I think they'll still be in the settlement. They're selling out from it. We're not actually pressing the attack. We might as well whittle them down. It'll be an order resolve after this, I imagine. But just in case it's not. The cavalry run into that group of archer militia. And then they'll be gone. What's causing that massive shadow? Of course, it's the, the mountains. And there we go. A close victory. 
got like a little it's smidge dicey but we still have of our 2700 strong force we have 2134 remaining so we're all good cavalry smashed all the faces trebs helped too it's 582 in that not bad they lost 4600 odd wow uh yeah we'll execute you and we'll also ransom Well, we should be able to get our Onyx Dragons this coming turn, which means we can then push in against Simma Jong and, well, not against Simma Jong first, but Simma and Jin, so I always forget. Oh, they've declared war. Oh, cool. Well, we'll make them happy then. Field Surgery, good, good. Attacker Reinforcements. Push a Dong War further. Do nothing, don't call reinforcements. Um... Um, don't don't call them. I'm gonna say don't don't call them. Don't need them. Don't comment up yet. Promote. Oh, the gin moving in as well. Everyone's trying to get in there. In on the action. Green estates. Upgrade them again. We can if we need to. Our food is fine though. I uh, I was right in thinking it was my yellow turban series where I was. Struggling a little bit for food, but I've managed to turn that around as well, which is all good. So, yes, we now have Onyx Dragons. Uh, the Retinue Upkeep Reduction. Yeah, let's just go straight into that. I'm not hearing any other suggestions otherwise. I don't think we need to. Oh, looks good. I'm oh, being reinforced by the Jin Empire as well now. Against the, the remaining 300. Thanks for showing up for the, the last of it, guys. You know, it's, it's nice that you're here, though. Nice, nice that you're here. That's what matters. Death. Promote. Take a look at the new people we've got. I didn't realize we've got an iron... Of course, it's the iron mine. The Bidong iron mine. Uh, I mean, I could go up here. And tell, but hey-ho, we're going to have a showdown with Simway. Don't think he can get on land and attack us. He's at full speed. Yeah, you know, he won't be able to. He'll probably pull back, though, if he sees the Jin Empires here, too. Uh, Lumberyard, yes. Up your defenses. Chuck that right in there. Simiyong... What are we going for? Tenacity of Steel. Oh, boy. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, we will be wanting that for sure. We went for Reach. So here we go. Diligence and up. That's Melee Evasion. Own Retinue. We don't have Melee Infantry. That's Own Army. Zeal and Melee Attack Rate for him. So I think that's what we'll go for. I've just realized how how it's stitched together as well. It's not all along the top. A little things I'm noticing. Yeah, that one. Then Tenacity of Steel. Uh, I know he's all about instinct, but that's just too good not to have when he's dueling. We can always go for Fury if we want to. Uh, any accessories? Not ones we really need to give you. Uh, Spy, we've got that one. Who's in Hedong. Which I'd end up killing, I think. And we move in there soon, so we'll need to see if we can get a way to get him out of there. Otherwise, we lose him. But yeah, we're going to go after these guys. We just need to get the archers in. Onyx Dragon. Let's swap. Oh, they going to be brutal. I mean, how do they how do they compare to regular archer militia? So their range is one of the biggest things. 250, so they, they um, can match crossbows. What's that? What's that? Range base damage is 48, and that one is, I'm assuming, arm piercing. So not as much arm piercing actually as Archer Militia, but uh, range attack rate, they fire faster. More health. And they're actually decent in the fight as well. Melee, I think. More ammo. Yeah, they're going to cost a lot. We only have enough to probably do this one army with them. But we'll be... Sorting out all of our forces to uh, have some lovely Onyx Dragons in them uh, in the future. Although, what is that? Think about it. What's their upkeep? 240. Okay, how's that compared to regular Arch Militia? Ooh, yeah, I would say our economy has dropped a little bit, but we are going to be going on the, uh, the war path. So, we've got the trade port to go after over there. That is my. That's my spy. Oh, cool. He's not in Hedong anymore. So actually, it might be an idea to go across the other way and grab that before he moves on in. Also, you guys are saying I still need uh, Liu Yang for victory, I believe. Control the capital. 
or at least for this mission. Um, but obviously I don't want to go to war with the Jin Empire, so I think I might just see if we can trade for it at some point. Um, so we'll try that in a little bit. But we, we could wait for these guys to be fully replenished. But I really want to see them in action. So if we just go and fight this one here. Oh yeah, she, I should should I, I should probably declare it the old-fashioned way, shouldn't I? I don't know if it makes any difference. Let's find out. Uh, declare alliance. Well, no, we'll just declare, we'll declare a normal one. Oh, and yes, because when we do this, we'll be able to get trade with Simi Yui, our new vassal, uh, because he's currently trading with them. Uh, if we tell him to then join join in the war, that is. So, issue declaration. Whoa! And I think that's going to be my plan... Uh, who are they asking? Requests military support. Okay, are they going to call in? Okay, are you called in? I'm kind of confused. You're... Or are they just putting the feelers out? Seeing if anyone will show up. I'm going to smush you though, probably in this turn. So that's not going to happen. Uh, but yeah, probably my plan going forward will be to break each of the other princes and then maybe just go on a massive annexation spree can you can you annex faction after faction after faction i know that will wreck your reliability but right at the end of the campaign it won't really matter but i wouldn't mind subduing them all um by vassal like breaking them getting to the point where they they break and then they agree to be my vassal and then i can just gobble them all up it'll be one or two where it won't be worthwhile vassalizing them but if they're slightly bigger then um yeah anyway right let's go attack this lumber yard Normally don't like to fight these because of the map. They actually have decent forces, but I just want to see these Onyx Dragons so bad. I won't do a night battle because I want to see them nice and clearly. In we go! I'm like just toying with my food now. Right. Let's have a look at them first of all, before I inevitably forget and they just get butchered. I mean I'm loving I'm loving the blue guys. You got decent swords. Yeah, I'm just hoping we can see our foes just disappear. I think we'll just bombard this first tower section. We've got flaming shot. And actually, is our range enough almost hit those towers before might just be on the cusp of it before they can start firing at me um i think i'll just have you guys group together and we'll charge on in right over here if we can be hidden you guys go hide there and we'll just charge in there and then we'll keep all of this cavalry here Right. Okay, I think we'll just wander into the range of the towers. Be able to fire. So we'll then need to just pull them back, but it should be probably only take a single volley. Yeah, fire damage. Already there. Pull back before you take too many casualties. Both those towers are on fire. They're all pulling out from here. That's fun. We can slam into them with our cavalry. I like that they're coming out to us as well. In fact, I'm just going to tell my trebs just to fire on that point. Oh, archers. Yeah, let's just change you back over to standard shot, though. Be more effective. That unit's... That's the unit's going down. Here we go. Regular shot. They won't even make it to me. Those guys. Uh, 
You guys want to fire from them pretty badly. That's all good. Just managed to stop. Cavalry getting wrecked getting into all those spears. In goes the heavy cataphracts. Oh, one of them's gone. Lance militia. You guys need a bit of an upgrade now, I think. Into the back of them. I meant to do that with you, strategist. Sorry. Spear warriors just shredded. Pull back, reform. Yeah, shredding all of our foes. Oh, cavalry's got in behind. Nice, go take out that tower. They're going to break any second. There's the victory. Didn't even have to go inside except that one unit that retreated in there. Decisive victory. Right, that's one of their territories down. Good, good. That's 488. That's fine. Archer's got plenty of kills. Should all replenish in yeah, one or two turns. That's all good. We don't have enough to upgrade any of you guys. You're still the wounded. Thank Fang. Ooh, and they've got they've got an army in there. Ho ho ho! Close defeat. They might they might sally out to me, but I think we can actually demand to end. No, they're not going to tell you. Um we we could slog on through. If we just wait a turn, we can bring our other army on over. Fought plenty of them. We'll uh, we'll chuck in rams and that and just wait until they uh come out to us. Draws in some Jong. Like I I might I could peace out with him, but I think it might Or rather vassalize him, but I think it might just be easier to storm on through and take everything that he's got. Upgrade that because that will get us the higher industry income, and that's our big earner. You guys, ah, oh yes, we didn't have enough for all the cavalry, did we? Um, just because we don't want to be sat here. Let's chuck one of those. Oh, and you've got that one. Probably better just to wait till next turn. Um, actually, no, it wouldn't be. It'd get the get the cavalry unit in, and then we'll swap on over. Now to save militia, if we can afford another foul sword guard cavalry, that'd be grand. Uh, right, you're going to go in for the ports. Oh no, actually, no, I was going to take you over to the city, wasn't I? We can get that while those guys are away. I can force march further. Do we need to replenish? I think the best army, to be fair. It's fine. Uh, that's just the fact they've got three heroes. It's a little bit troublesome. Right, let's see what Simway does during the end turn phase. Uh, we can do the sneaky request. Call him to arms against you guys. Confirm. That frees up a trade slot, which means I can then get trade with you. It's a maybe, though. Oh, really? He is, he is not keen on that. Right. Well, a war axe here, which I'm probably not going to use. Uh, probably, I'm not going to use that. Have a fan as well. Is that enough to make it work? Oh, it's not. Okay, I mean, it's because he still hates me. I should probably just, um, maybe I should just give him something. 
That will improve things. Yes. Okay, let's do that. Let's give, gift him a war axe and he'll trend towards being happy. And he should also be happy that I'm taking these guys out and doing actions against them. Right. End turn. Pull that army along the river. That's fine. Um, question much support against Sai Khan. Who is Sai Khan? Oh, to the south of them. Um... I mean, if I decline, does it does it really matter? I'm not gonna, cause I'm. I'm gonna say no, cause yeah, I don't, don't think we need to. You've vassalized somebody, and you've liberated them. Central traitor. Okay, dissatisfaction. Oh, God. Appreciation. Uh, execute them. Um, how close are we to more might? Yeah, we are We are pretty close. Execute them. Give me all that might. And who was that? How, how close are we as well? 605. Yeah, 11. Good. Yeah, some of you guys are saying I should, I should make someone else... My heir rather than Simmer Song. I mean, we could go for Simmer Dew. Take over as a vanguard. But we probably have a regency. So. I don't know. You guys, you guys feel free to, feel free to weigh on in. Hopefully, Timiong isn't going to go anywhere. Uh, I'm surprised they didn't sally on out. If we bring these guys over, we can just order as over though. It's not like we fought enough sieges so far in this campaign. Lost the cavalry, but they'll be back. Oh, Gongsun Yui. Um, well, there's death to everyone, really. Timo Xing. Give me all your stuff. Uh, oh, yeah, I didn't ch check my promoted characters, did I? Oh, it's, <laughs> it's the triple commander threat. But now you're all happy. You're costing me 17. So that's okay. Um, I think we've just had some of our deals end. That's why. Mahjong. I mean, if I can... I need to vassalize you, really. But if not, you'll be you'll be my next target then. You're also awesome, you. Um, So he's probably not going to like that. <laughs> he's not going to like that either, is he? Um... Where is this person? Oh, they're all the way down there. Oh, actually, we've got we've got a butt ton of food. Oh crap! No, don't do not really. Food to them is only worth that. God damn! Yeah, that's not worth it. What about you, sir? Well, oh, and it's trending toward war atrocities against our friend because I I killed your friend. Sorry. I mean, you don't have any allies. But yeah. Being a bad, bad boy. Um, Food? No. Doesn't really scratch the itch. Right. So it's time to... No, it's definitely not time to offer that. I'm just going to give you all this armor. There's probably my own people that need it. Mm, but the reductions... Actually, no, yeah. Sentinel armor is always hard to come by. Have that. Red thoroughbred and have we've got a spare of this fan, so you know what? I'm just gonna give you some gifts. Like me a little bit more, would you? But yeah, your friend Simon John's gonna have to die, so maybe you won't be able to get trade until after that. Um I might just be able to just took one of his which ones do we do we want or need? Um we got plenty it's, it's, it's only the it's two two region provinces, commanderies. Kill him. Let's just go finish him off now and we don't have to worry about him. Some of you he can stay though, but I might as well grab this because it'll be 
all around the territory, all, all nice and pretty. So move you guys to strike the livestock farm in a single strike, and you guys will move position three to take uh, Bay High. Don't know where um, Wang Bao's gone though. Their champion. Um, you sir. Probably going to go for that one to get more resolve, which makes you legendary. You can have better armor. There you go. Don't say I never give you anything. That's those guys sorted over there. Got all the food income right now. Uh, food production peasantry. I need to. I need to look at my most profitable regions. What I'm thinking is we try and ambush him. I don't know if he will move with the uh, the Jin Empire right there, or maybe they'll move in. And chase him away. Otherwise, I go after him now. I mean, I should be able to. We're not. How weakened are we? Infantry's fine. They've got all these two spearmen. Cavalry wise, though, they've got one unit of cataphracts. And they've four archers, and they've got one mounted saber. I mean, we should smash. Let's have a showdown with Simulway. A close defeat. They're not moved by a thousand. Okay, right. Well, actually just looked at the time. Fortunately, we need to wrap things up here for today, but we will have our showdown against them away at the start of the next episode. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. I hope you're looking forward to the next one. Until then, don't forget to comment and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter, take pride and join the Legion. Check out my affiliates and sponsors, Games Planet, Overclockers UK, and QT. Till the next one, ciao for now.